Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to WatchMojo.com. I'm internationally famous comedian John Hastings. And who's next to me? That's not Veronica Delfina, who usually I yell at about weird stuff like Twilight. Mm -mm. Not today. I classed it up for you, kitty cats, because we got ourselves former war crimes lawyer all the way from The Hague, now a comedian in Montreal, my dear, 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 dear good friend, Jessica Solomon. Jessica, welcome to WatchMojo.com. Thank you, John. I'm glad to be here. I know. It's a fun new segment we're trying out for you kids. A little segment called Ask a Lawyer. And what we're going to do is we're going to ask questions to a real-life lawyer, and then I'm going to make fart jokes to pass the time while you guys are supposed to be working in your cubicles. Good times. So Jessica, former war crimes lawyer, what would be the first most appropriate question? This is actually a question I got myself from a comedian at a comedy show. Let me see if you can find a little something out about this guy. First question of Ask a Lawyer is, Jessica, how legal is weed. It's been pretty much decriminalized, I think, in practice. I think if you have possession of weed, uh, a small amount for personal use, uh, I don't think you're going to get hauled into jail for that. It's weird, the word decriminalized sounds so much worse than illegal. Do you know what I mean? Like, it sounds like the robot steroided version of illegal. You know what I mean? Like, he's been decriminalized, which means they, like, deloused a criminal. Right. And now he's, like, a f horribly remodeled version of society, and he's really into the Baptist church and stuff like that. So if I did have a nug of weed given to me by the cameraman just before we started shooting and the cops raided, I would not have to go to the clink, is what you're saying? I don't think that they would waste their resources on that. All right, next question. This is actually a question I came up with because I've always wanted to know, what exactly is insider trading? It's pretty much when you have inside information because you work at a company and let's say you find out that, you know, you know that you're coming out with a new product that's going to make your stock go up. Uh, you buy a whole bunch of that stock and make a lot of money off of it. I think that's what it is. So like a social version of insider trading is like you're with some buddies and you find out from one of those buddies that one of his friends who is a girl is kind of into you. So right. you, you now have the inside track. You don't need to like do right. the stupid like, hey, can I buy you a drink? You can just sort of walk up and be like, so I hear, what can I do if naked pictures of me are posted on the internet? I don't really know that there's much you can do about stuff that goes up on the internet. It's just, it's very difficult with the internet to, to find the originator of it. You know, often it's like a company, I think, that um, buys, would buy the pictures from somebody, mm. and then, you know, they're like sex video or naked picture companies, and they profit off of this, and they put it up. So I think, yeah, if you have a hard-hitting lawyer that um, goes up against them and, like, basically threatens them with legal action and a huge then, lawsuit and then you'd go to court you get an injunction and hopefully you know they would be forced to take them down mm -hmm. um, then you know you could you could do something about it it just there's there's you know there's the law and then there's you know the uh, the practice and what you know what's actually practicable so ladies and gentlemen this has been our first segment of ask Alert. how did it feel jessica solomon oh it felt fun it was good yeah if only the bar exam was uh That's this fun. oh was well tough as, yeah don't this bury the don't now. bury the lead don't bury the lead because next up <laughs> next ask a lawyer we're going to ask her about the bar exam and why is it called the bar exam for watchmojo.com and jessica solomon i'm john hastings have a good one